Okay, guys, um, I just wanted to do a quick little video in regards to your um, link to your website. And so to get to your website, you can go to Google screen, go to the nine little dots, click on sites. Um, you should go, you should click on here and do owned by me. So if you go by owned by anyone, it might pull up a whole bunch of different people's if they've shared it publicly. So if you do owned by me, it'll come up with just your site. So click on that. And then the other thing you want to do is you want to go back into Google Classroom, go all the way down to intro and click on step two website link and make sure you have the Excel spreadsheet open. Okay. And so now I have the Excel spreadsheet open. Make sure you find your class period, fifth, fourth, third, second, make sure these colored um, pages come up down here. If they don't, this little sandwich thing right here will do it also. And you can click which class you're in and what you need and they're color coded. Okay. To try to help you guys find them. And so while you're in here, you want to go to the paperclip and you want to hit copy link. Then you want to clip on your website and then click on the space next to your name and you can right click and hit copy. You can hit um, edit and copy, or you can hit control V and copy. Okay. And it puts everything in there next to your name. Okay. And so that's how you're going to get your link into the student website Excel spreadsheet so that I can click on it and look at it. It should not be your URL. You're not going to go up here and copy this because what this is going to take me to is the editing site for your site. And I'm not going to have access to it. Okay, so it's not going to do anything. It's going to give me an error message. Okay, so I don't want the URL. I need the link to your site that people can see. And so that's why you do it this way. All right, guys, there you go.